I'm 17 years old. I'm a young black male. But I'm tired of watching America burn to the ground every single night. Communities across the country, from Dallas to Minnesota, and they say that they're doing it for me, for people that look like me. How does endangering black lives show that black lives matter? Well, that was C.J. Pearson from Atlanta, Georgia, taking a stand against rioters and looters who he said are taking advantage of George Floyd's unfortunate death. And that's not all. The YouTube creator, along with the Georgia Association of Minority Entrepreneurs, has taken steps to rebuild his community destroyed by looters and rioters. And he's so impressive. Look at this. He helped uh, re create a relief fund that's raised $160,000 to provide much-needed relief to black-owned small businesses who have been destroyed by rioters. And joining us now is C.J. Pearson. Welcome. Thank you, Lindsay, for having me, Sean. It's a pleasure to be here as well. Good to see you again, man. Listen, uh, I, I don't, I mean, I, I've been in campaigns for a long time. People are always trying to raise money. You raised 160000 uh, I, bucks. I mean, that's a pretty substantial amount of money. How did you do it? I mean, did you send out to family and friends? Did you, I mean, like, how did you just, did it come pouring in? But I, I think this is pretty impressive how much you raised in such a short period of time. I appreciate that so much, Sean. And it was an entirely social media led effort. You know, I woke up one morning and, and, and you saw that video. I was tired of watching America burn. I was definitely tired of seeing people say that it was for me. It was for my black life. And, and I wanted to put some actions behind some of the words I had seen. I'd seen so many prominent celebrities posting black screens, but none of them actually chipping in and doing something. So we created this campaign. We set an initial goal of just $30,000 and we blew through that goal in just a three hour time period. And by that week's in, we were able to raise more than $160,000 which is gonna go directly to black owned businesses to help them reopen and rebuild after the terrible attacks they suffered from far left wing activists. That's so amazing, uh, your story. And I know that you've been so out outspoken, um, not only about what's happening right now, but around the election. But you're just 17 years old, so you can't even vote in this upcoming election. Uh, but you've been active to young voters. What would you tell first time voters out there what's important in this election? Well, I actually do have the uh, opportunity to vote in this upcoming election in November. All so right. I'll be I'll be 18 by then, casting my first vote for President Trump. And my message to first-time voters is this. You know, America has now found itself at a time for choosing. Once again, we have to decide the type of nation we will be. Will we be a nation where free market ideals reign supreme? Or will we be a nation uh, defined by lawlessness, open borders, and just far left-wing radicalism? The choice that I'm making is one that President Trump has made clear. It is time for us to make America great again in every sense of the word. And I'm looking forward to casting my vote for the president. And I believe that every member of our generation should do the same so that we can ensure that we inherit a country that we can be proud of and a country worth continuing to fight for. With a, with a response like that and the ability to raise money, CJ, I'm pretty certain I can say that I'm going to see your name on a ballot at some point in my lifetime because you seem to have what it's going to take to uh, to win an election. So I, I know that, you know, I don't want to get too far ahead, but man, I can see myself casting a ballot for you at some point. Let me ask you this. How many businesses have you helped? So last week we made our first contribution of $10,000 to uh, the Wilborn Sister of Designs, a small business in Atlanta. We've already identified uh, three more businesses that we're going to help with $3,000 donations in total. And we're looking for even more. Uh, so if you are a business that's been affected by these riots and, and these violence, please reach out to me. I want to help you. I, I want to provide you the relief that you need. It's a shame that th these protests evolved in the way that they did. Uh, but we want to help you get the relief that you need to reopen and rebuild. Uh, because this is right, this CJ, is where, where do they go? Where do people go if they want to help? Yeah, they can visit CJPearson.org. CJPearson.org. All right, man. Thank you. And congratulations on all the good that you're doing. I really think that's awesome. You just watched Newsmax TV, America's fastest growing news channel, now in 65 million homes. Get Newsmax TV on all the major cable systems or go to NewsmaxTV.com and click on the Find Newsmax tab to locate us. Remember, Newsmax TV, where real news for real people.